there right now welcome back to dust till dawn lips welcome back to dtd lips honey welcome back to this this lifestyle chat i'm so happy to see you i'm so excited that you could join me um and i just this video i want to start trying on some colors i also want to give you guys a background as to well, why is she a credible source? Well, who is she? Why is India, you know, a self-proclaimed connoisseur of lip gloss? Where, who is she? What is she all about? What is, what is all this? I want to give you guys the backstory of uh, this lip gloss, okay? And I also want to try on a few colors of the first collection, the Pink Effect collection. So I'm gonna give you a, a few of those and so you can kind of see like the colors and you can see the pigment, and you can see the gloss and you can really see how awesome and vibrant it all is and see how it's gonna work in your life from dusk till dawn. So let's get into it. Let's, let's get into it. Let's talk about some lips, okay? We've got a Estee Lauder lip. My good old friend Nars, my good boy, my good friend Tommy Boy, Tom Ford. Um, I think I've got a Chanel in here somewhere. A lot of these are MAC. Y'all, this is all lipstick, lip gloss, okay? Lip gloss. I've got a mixture in here, lip gloss, lip gloss. This is all, this is, this is what I do. And this has just been like my collection throughout the years. This is like my go-to and it would no longer fit in a regular makeup bag. So I had to actually start using like industrial size bags for this provided by my mother. Thank you, mommy. Um, but yeah, I have pretty much everything that you could think of. Oh, like this one, they kind of let me down. Um, this little bitty tube right here, this is a lipstick. This is by Tom Ford. I love Tom Ford. I love his scents. I, I really do, and I like a lot of colors, but this one let me down, and I ended up, what is this color? This is Justin, uh, number 27, and I ended up not purchasing any more of his brand because I was kind of upset that it's, y'all, it's this small for almost $40. I want to say it retails at like $36, $37, maybe a little bit more. Um, honestly, it was really close to $40 for this tube. And so I really wanted the color to pop and it not be drying. And for some reason, the formula, I don't know what it was, it didn't work for me. Um, but I mentioned before that I have everything from like, this is like Walgreens brand. This is this is the, the beeswax, right? This is the beeswax brand. But the color popped out to me. So of course, um, I couldn't leave it. I had to purchase it. One of my favorites in here, NARS, the NARS brand which I must say, our formula is very similar. Um, and, you know, they. I, this is probably one, one of my favorite brands since before it was popping. Like, probably, I'd say that I found the NARS brand like when I was like a senior in high school. So this has like been a staple in my life since I was really young. My trusty Bobbi Brown Cosmetics, always awesome. Um, Honestly, they are another one that, that was one of my go-tos prior to me launching Dust Till Dawn. Because right now, honest, I, I must tell you guys, the Pink Effect collection is awesome. And this is coming from somebody who, you guys can see it, I live and breathe it, right? A lot of these are MAC, a lot of these are, you know, like a higher brand, a higher end brands. I've got Chanel in here somewhere. Um, but I just want you guys to see my truth, that I really do have everything from, uh, honestly, like a dollar store to like um, Victoria's Secrets. I've got, uh, I think it's NYX. I always just call it NYX, but it's NYX. Uh, Sephora brand is in here as well. Got a, a Juicy Tube, Lancome. I've got everything, honestly. I've got uh, Anastasia in here. I've got everything in here and I have been doing this, I'm I didn't even know that I was doing like research, <laughs> but I have been. I've been doing this research 
for so long and I think that it was just like the next step for me to create my own brand and really bring out my own product and something that worked for every everybody and something that worked for that real lip gloss addict like myself, something that you guys would really enjoy. I wanted to discuss this one though because this plumper is one that I actually put on a lot of times prior to putting my brand on just because I have thinner lips. I have, well, my top lip is a little bit thinner. So I do like to put this on typically at night. I'd say if I'm going out, the, the rare chance that I'm going out, I'll put this on and then I'll put my product on. So it is the um, Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme. And I gotta tell you guys, it definitely does work. It does tingle a bit. And I'll say the tingling feeling for me lasts for like at least 10 to 15 minutes which um, but when it's done you still have that full effect and it's just like an awesome little what would I call it it's like an awesome background or it creates an awesome palette I don't really creates it creates this awesome palette for my dust till dawn brand and for um, our colors since I'm mentioning our colors and talking about it right now I currently have on, this is Adore You from Death Till Dawn. And the reason why I like this is that it's kind of like an everyday color. Uh, Adore You goes on very easily, like so. And I like it because for me, I like a lot of color. However, if you did not want the intensity of this color, it's not necessary. Uh, but no, you won't necessarily get that is what I'm saying. Like, it's buildable. That's the awesome part of the Dust Till Dawn product is that it is buildable. So um, you start off and it, it can be like just like a thin layer for you know something simple or you can build it and get more of a, a pop of color. My next one is blush. And I kind of wanted to show you guys what they were actually going to be looking like, right? So I'm gonna wipe this one away. Wipe that away like so, and blush. A little bit more pinky than my previous color. Works great on any skin tone, um, but especially like. I'd say like for like us brown girls out there, like this is like a perfect pink. It's definitely not too chalky. Um, it's not something that's gonna make you look like dried out, obviously, right? This is like a hydro, a hydro gloss. But it's just, it's one of those colors that's not gonna kind of make you look like a clown. Like <laughs> some of those colors can just be way too overpowering. Um, and look a little bit silly but this one is just like natural but it's still enough and like I said it's buildable so if you wanted more of a color you could just put on a few more layers for a night out which I love and you'll see like with the application this is more of a pop color I probably would dial this one back and mix it with so I probably put this one on and then dial it back with my adore you this one is baby doll I like baby doll a lot but I just put one layer on and I typically will mix it. So you see how like you're still getting that intensity, but you muted it a bit with Adore You. Because at first it was kind of like, ah, like really in your face. And it still is like the color's coming through still, but then it's just, for me, I just feel like it's more like every day, right? Like it's more something, it's, it's like, um, I walked in the room, you see me, I see you, but I didn't overpower you. <laughs> That's what that sound is. This is Berry Shake. Boom. Look at that. This is almost like, because I know a lot of you have been in my DMs and my inbox um, and my Snap, whatever. I don't know what those are called on Snap. I told you that. When did somebody drop something on Snap? I don't know. But y'all been like, oh, India, we want like a nude. Like, you know, with the pink effect, you're going to have like a nude. This is like a, a, a nude. This is a color that's going to work on your skin as like a nude lip. 
because um, this is really functional. This is really everyday. This is very simple. You could do this with a sultry eye. Um, you could do this with, you know, your big sunglasses, no makeup, and just throw this on. Like, this is very much a staple gloss that I think everybody should have. I think if you're debating the colors between, like, you know, do I want Baby Doll? Do I want Adore You? Like, which one do I want? I think this one is definitely going to be, like, a no-brainer, right? Um, because of the versatility of it. Oh, and last but not least, y'all. My fruit punch brings all the boys to the yard. And it's better than yours. And it's better than yours. This is the one that's been getting all of the attention. I'm talking about, I ran into one of my old friends. And this is no lie. I ran into one of my old friends. And I walked up to him and I'm like, hey! Gave him a big hug. Asked him about his new baby. Such, 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 such. Catch nuts. And do you know this man was like, oh, and I see you're doing dust till dawn. And he was like, I'm gonna need some of that fruit punch. I, what? <laughs> what do you know about fruit punch? Ah, uh, this is the infamous fruit punch. Fruit punch is very pinky. And it's one that I layer. That's a, so this is the first one if you just wanted it, whatever. Of course, with me, I'm extra, I'm extreme. So I'm gonna put on a little bit more. It's a simple pink, y'all, but something about Fruit Punch is just, it's easy. Probably, I think it's probably like my favorite. Um, not even just my favorite out of my collection, but it's probably in my top five favorite lip glosses of all time. This, this is probably not even top five, this is probably number one. Because of how easy it is, how nice it goes, my complexion, how versatile it is. Um, buildable. The pink is the perfect pink. It's, this is the perfect pink. This one here, this fruit punch, <laughs> just be ready to bring them to the yard. Don't don't play around. If you're going to bring out fruit punch, just be ready for some compliments and some attention and people, your lip, listen, it's bringing all the boys to the yard. Your lip gloss is popping. Every, it's there. The fruit punch is just awesome. It's just an awesome, perfect pink lip gloss. Child, this man came up to me and was like, and he gonna have to get some fruit punch for his girl. And I'm thinking, yes, fruit punch, bring them to the yard. Yes, okay, yes. This is awesome, it goes on really smooth. All the colors in my in, in my um, line actually go on like this, and they're all buildable, and all can be like mixed around, but this Pink Effect collection is something special to me, because I feel like every woman is always looking for that perfect pink, and this collection is gonna offer that to you. No matter what your skin tone is, no matter you know your race, we're going to be able to fit into your life and work for you from dusk till dawn. And just how it compares right now to um, other products out there on the market and what we're bringing to you. Definitely high quality at um, an affordable price. So yeah, I hope everybody had a great week too, by the way. And thank you for subscribing. Thank you for following me on Snapchat, DTD Lips. Thank you for those follows on Instagram, Dust Till Dawn Lips, or at Dust Till Dawn Lips. And thank you for just the kind words and um, for really supporting me. From the time that I launched this brand and I started discussing it a few weeks ago, just on my own personal social medias, you guys have been there really supporting me and, and um, I've gotten endless calls and text messages from friends and friends and family. You know, when is the collection dropping? How can I get it? You know, even strangers inboxing me. Hey, love what you're doing. This is awesome. I appreciate all that support and energy. It really feeds me and it helps motivate me. Um, I've also, you know, gotten like, well, well, why do you want to watch a launch of lip gloss? Or how did you choose that? Or whatever else. That motivates me too because I cannot wait for you to actually try my product and try my brand so that you can understand why I'm bringing this to you. It is my gift to the world.